Hello and welcome everyone to the next episode on anubhavtrainings.com on SAP Analytics Cloud. In this episode, we will understand can we integrate our SAC stories as part of Fury applications developed in the company? Yes, definitely you can do that. And it's very, very simple. So what I'm going to show in this demo is how exactly this integration is typically achieved and what are all the ingredients required to make this dish. So let's get started. So what we need exactly is, let me just draw it quickly for all of you, how exactly the integration can be achieved. So typically on one side, we have SAP Analytics Cloud, where we have all the different stories being created. And you will have the multiple stories out here. Now, what you're going to do is you will probably want one or multiple stories to be integrated with SAC. So right now, let's consider one. So what you need to do is uh, on top of your story, you're going to find a share button, something like this. When you click on that, you're going to get a URL, a public URL for that story. And now this URL can be the base for your integration. Now on the other side, we are building Fury applications as part of our gateway system or Cloud Foundry native applications using SAP Application Studio. So we have the Fury app which you typically build using MVC architecture. And the tool which we use here is SAP Web IDE tool to develop the same. Now, what you're going to do is take this URL. And of course, since you use MVC architecture in Fury, so we have controller, we have model, and we also have a view. So when you're creating an XML view in Fury, what you do is you go to create a kind of a container which is what going to contain this, this URL basically. So it's going to redraw the entire story coming from SAC as part of your view. And this container, we call it as iframe, which I anyway covered as part of my UI5 and Fury training. If you have not attended the same, you should do that to become an expert on Fury development from scratch. It's an absolute beginner's course. Also on the other side, if you want to learn SAC, then you can also attend our SAP Analytics Cloud training from the scratch. So now what we do is typically take this URL and embed the story over here. And then of course, when you execute your application, you're gonna see your Fury application is gonna run with its frame. Of course, this is Fury frame. And then your SAC story is gonna display over here. Yeah, so all your SAC charts and stories and everything is gonna come. So what I have here is I've already, um, done that so i'm going to quickly show you so i've already an sac productive instance and i've created here an sac poc application it's a fury application as you can see running on my local web ide and here i have my view where i've integrated the same so i can go back and show you the result of this on my output so you can see this is how it looks like you can see it's running on a local host and it's connected to sap analytics cloud and all my data source including my smart analytics um, forecasting story pages or um, smart insight. Everything is visible here for me as part of well integrated in my Fury application. You can see all the data coming from SAC. All my pages are visible here, which I can, of course, use them. All the functionalities, drill downs, hierarchies, all these functionalities can, of course, um, be consumed right away as part of my uh, Fury application. So this is how exactly we can fetch data. And of course, we can fetch and bring all our stories right into our Fury based applications as far as um, Fury and SAC integration is con concerned. So, so that's it for the day. I hope you enjoyed this session. Of course, if you would like to learn how to build this such a Fury application, feel free to subscribe our course on anubhavtrainings.com. With that, Anubhav signing out. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.